Hi everybody, this is Kevin again. Today, I bring you guys 132 scale Skyline GTR R34. This is made by Jetta Toys. And let's take a look. This is the iconic Skyline GTR that being featured in Fast and Furious 4, the one driven by Paul Walker. Seems that we're in the front, and let's check out the front end, shall we? So, as you can see there, the front headlamp has a very good in-depth to it. Unfortunately, because there's the silver, there's no black bits. There's no black paint inside the headlamp, so it looks slightly unrealistic. But overall, overall, I would say, good job, because it looks very good. Even the black front, front splitter is there as well, so it looks decent. Thumbs up. Let's look at the side. Let's just close. Let's look at the side here. The side looks very good as well. Again, it looks very good. You had silver indicator light here, but it's supposed to have a GT emblem here, but it's missing. I guess that's for cost saving measure, which I can understand. And let's take a look at the wheels. The wheels looks decent enough. It's not it's not the best, but I would say it's okay. The only issue of the wheel I will tell I will tell you guys later. It's not very significant but it's quite annoying. So overall the sign looks very good. Let's check the rear of the car. So we have quad tail quad tail light as a symbol of the GTR of course. With the GTR's emblem, the Fast Furious there, the reverse light. I think that's reverse light, that's brake light, that's another brake light. So yeah, overall, exhaust tips. Spoiler. And spoiler is plastic. This is... This is plastic spoiler. That's not metal spoiler, but the paint job on that... The paint job on that plastic spoiler looks quite nice, so you can't really tell the difference just by looking at it. So, like what you guys seeing here, there's doors can be open, but that's it, no more than that. The interior originally come with black interior, nothing is painted, everything is black, there's no sticker for the dashboard, there's nothing. So I use my silver marker, I paint the NOS bottle black, there's three NOS bottle here, it's black, but I painted silver, so it looks more realistic anyway. There's there's three there's three gauges there and the monitor at the front passenger seat there. So that's quite realistic in detail. Let's check out the driver's seat. The Skyline comes with right hand drive, so obviously the seat is here. And you see here, I pay I paint the seat white because I think it will stands out a lot. And turns out it is. I was thinking to paint it red, but so far I just want to leave it like as it is. So steering wheel is quite nicely molded. I paint the I paint the metal bit silver because I think that's the, what real car looks like. It also come with a roll cage, very thin very thin roll cage, but. It's there, so yeah, not too bad. Overall, I would say this skyline that I made by Jada is good. There's a 124 and 118 scale. The reason I didn't get those of them in terms of these smaller scale is the proportion of the wheel. At 124 scale, the wheel arch is massive. The rim is massive. It just looked like it doesn't, doesn't look like race car anymore. It looks like those gigantic toys that Jada used to make. Well, they're still they they still doing that, but that's one of the trade one of the signature in terms of the Jada toys. So yeah, I guess you can't really blend it too much. But these one thirty two scale, the wheels looks decent. The proportion is good. And the last thing I want I want to tell you guys. Is how slim the wheel is. 
that that wheel, the width of the wheel, is smaller than my pinky. Is it's just too small? It's just too small. Oh, by the way, the black box, the back box is paid by me as well. So overall, if you want, if you want a GTR, you either can go to Greenlight. Greenlight also do a Fast and Furious Four GTR blue one, but with twice of twice of the price tag. In UK at least. So if you want a, if you want affordable, decent looking, decent amount of detail, correct proportion GTR R thirty four with Fast and Furious on it. I guess I guess Jada is your best option to go. Until then, see you guys next time. Then, bye.